Tonight, the ongoing battle against the opioid drug epidemic is front and center in the public spotlight. 7th District U.S. Congressman David Rouser created a group to spread awareness and information. They took part in this panel discussion that our Andrew James sat in on and joins us now in studio with more. Well, Amanda, this symposium comes after months of planning by the congressman and others, bringing together folks from every level, from the recovery clinic all the way up to the USDA, to reach those struggling and inform others. We're saying that we're going to celebrate recovery wherever it's found. A conversation they've all had before. When you're done, you're done, you're determined, you're done. Nothing can come between that. Now, all united on one stage and one platform to educate and reach out to those struggling with an opioid addiction. This is a, uh, an issue that touches every family in one way or the other. Uh, if you don't have a family member that's suffering uh, through this, uh, then most folks know another family. Uh, that is uh, that is suffering through it. Congressman David Rouser bringing together key local figures who are tackling the opioid epidemic through treatment, prevention, and law enforcement. His idea to launch this committee coming from Alicia Roberts, who has a coalition of her own. Tonight is proof that um, we do have a voice, and if we will speak out even when we're not sure that we're going to get that response that we're looking for, that sometimes we do. Roberts lost her 25-year-old daughter to the epidemic. A year ago, she reached out to the congressman to join their effort to bring those addicted to recovery as well as safety. To her surprise, he answered the call. Extremely grateful. My heart's full. These people now elevate the message Roberts has for so many parents and victims. Don't lose hope, don't lose faith, and don't give up. Keep fighting. Congressman Rouser's staff will look at making this symposium an annual event for as long as it takes to continue spreading awareness. Amanda. 